So I reported directly to my ship following our graduation from NROTC, uh, and I believe over the last few years, JO training has uh, improved dramatically. I feel that uh, JOs coming to the fleet now are uh, much more uh, knowledgeable about uh, ship handling fundamentals and radar fundamentals uh, and other kind of basic uh, uh, facets of, of the uh, of SWO knowledge uh, than we were in the past. Uh, my JOs are definitely more confident. In, in fact, I had the opportunity this week to go to the uh, NSST simulator with some of my JOs to do some peer work, and I was definitely impressed with their uh, knowledge of fundamentals uh, and uh, their confidence in handling the ship, uh, which I had not kind of seen previously to uh, the BDOT course uh, uh, coming online. I've noticed that uh, JOs uh, definitely integrate uh, better uh, now uh, post uh, BDOT course. Uh, they're better at uh, maneuvering board fundamentals, uh, radar fundamentals, uh, they understand uh, off-ship communications better, as well as basic forces affecting the ship and, and how to maneuver, uh, be it during an unwrap or pre-work and, and uh, evolutions like that. I think it's important that the Navy continue uh, JO training uh, because it, it, the new ensigns will come with a greater degree of professionalism. Uh, they're aggressive in their qualifications, they have knowledge, and it also allows them to integrate into the team and it's better uh, for the ship overall uh, and the professionalism of the force.